Hello guys, how are you? Hope you all are doing well. Today I am back with one of the most interesting video. In this video tutorial, guys, we will learn how to fix on your Windows 11. There is no power option showing not available power option on your PC. So how to fix this irritating problem? In this video, now we will learn this, guys. Okay. So for this, guys, you can follow this easy and simple method. So I am going to show you five to six different different methods to fix that problem okay so please watch this video till and very carefully don't miss any option any method so let's get started so when you are facing this type of problem now you need to restart your pc firstly okay to restart the pc use the shortcut key hold alt key button from your keyboard and then press f4 okay it will show you restart prompt and restart your pc okay after restarting now hopefully this time it will fix your problem still in case you are facing same type of problem now you can try this next method okay now you need to hold windows key button and then press r and here you need to type jpedit.msc okay like this you need to type and then click on okay it will open the local group policy on your pc now in the left panel you need to extend user configuration and then extend administrative templates and then extend start menu taskbar just select it and in the right panel find out remove and prevent access to the shutdown just double click and open it and if the option was enabled just you need to disable or you need to set the not configure ok after this guys click on apply and click on ok and one more time you need to restart your pc after restarting now hopefully it will get back your power option in case still you are facing same type of problem now you can try this next method press windows key button and here you need to type control panel and open the control panel on your pc in the control panel open user account like this okay and in the left panel you can get the option configure advanced user profile properties just double click and open it and here you can get your profile name just you need to copy or note down this uh, profile name exactly okay and then close this close this and once again press windows key button and then press r and here you need to type secpol.msc and then click on ok and here you need to extend local policy in the right panel like this and here you need to extend user right assignment just extend this and in the right panel find out shut down the system just double click and open it and here you can get the option at user or group just click and open it and here you need to uh, type that user profile name you have copy from your control panel same as it is you need to uh, type or copy paste and then click on ok and close these settings after this guys now restart your pc one more time after restarting now hopefully this will fix your problem and then still you are facing same type of problem last and final solution is this guys you need to update your windows 11 to update your windows 11 Go to your windows settings like this and in the left panel go to windows update from here you can easily able to update your pc so this is the last and final solution to fix that problem okay so that's it for today guys the short and simple video hope you enjoy this if you enjoy please guys like share and subscribe to our channel thank you very very much